Welcome to Time on My Hands and today as I'm a heating engineer I'm going to have a look at this Sales Smart uh, Thermostat which is Boiler Plus compliant, compliant got a five year warranty is um, open therm as well and it's just a great bit of kit we've been using them for years as a company we've used oh, must, oh, nearly a thousand of these things obviously the different models over the years but if you open your box up then what you get inside is all of the usual gubbins so what we've got is we've got some instructions um, they're, they're a little bit uh, if I'm absolutely honest the instructions are a little bit pictogram from IKEA type instructions so what I'm gonna do that's the sort of garbage it gets with the instructions and like a little pictogram so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna give you a brief introduction to the uh, thermostat and um, just have a quick chat about it and then I'm gonna do like a how to program and all that kind of stuff but basically if you've got a heating system yeah uh, with a combination boiler or a uh, most boilers a combination or a system boiler or a um, just a regular boiler that uses a switch live can be run using this system it's just how all about how you wire it up so the, the thermostat receiver which is there is able to move a switch live across and it's also able to use 24 volt switching you know uh, as you might find in um, a lot of modern appliances these days but it's also able to use open therm as well which um, is is a uh, if your switch live switching is is just an on and off switch bang on off uh, um, a open therm circuit is uh, provides information to the thermostat the thermostat then calculates something and tells the boiler something so basically it's more like a volume control so as you get nearer and nearer your target temperature the, the thermostat will turn down the boiler so you won't get the the overshoot you would get with um, a simple on and off control unit anyway let's have a quick look at what we've got inside so i'm going to just open this up push the box to one side Yep, there it goes. Bit of packaging. Um, you get two things. You get the receiver unit and you get the head unit. So the head unit, which I'm just unpacking off screen because I can't. Oops, wobbly cam strikes again. Oh, open the batteries up. It comes with two batteries and they are Dura cells, which is good. For years, these uh, these have been coming with little yet yeah, golden coloured uh, batteries that you know, generic little cheapo things. Maxell, I think, but now we've got they're not Duracells. Duracell, yeah, they are. They uh, they look like them. They're not clones. They are real Duracells. And the, the unit itself, the the head unit, I just plucked the batteries in there. They say it says language. We'll look at that in a minute. But the head the head unit comes with a square industry standard back plate and a stand. Obviously, uh, one hand. Obviously, it's not wired. So, and as you can see, it's now saying language because I've just put the batteries in. Oh, there we go. And if you look inside this little unit here, you see you've got an own common that sees your switch on and off, and you've got live and neutral next to it, which is 240 volts, by the way. So you could use a live out of the live, put a loop into the common, and then use the live switched out of your NO to your boiler. You could use your NO and common to switch low voltage controls or even high voltage controls if you decided to use a four wire configuration and here we have the open therm so if you've got a boiler that is compatible with open therm you can wire it through that and as well as that you've got like a it's not industry standard uh, backplate but you've got your backplate 
and that screws to the wall. The wiring goes directly into this unit. And on the front of it, obviously we've got the on and off, self-explanatory. When it's on, you get a red light. If there's no connection between this unit and this unit, you get a flashing red light. And we've got auto and manual. Manual means it's on. You get a green light, the boiler fires up, okay? So if you decide to lose this little baby during a wild party or something like that, you, you haven't lost your heating, you can pop it in manual, green light, and you're away. Okay, well that's enough for now. Um, just to sum up, I think this is a fantastic piece of kit. And for the price point, and I'll post a few links below as to where you can get these from, but for the price point, I think they're great value for money. They're really great value for money. And uh, yeah, uh, for 50 quid plus VAT, you'd be daft not to.